In this video, I'm going to show you why your prop statics are black and what you can do to fix it. This only affects prop statics placed inside the map, and they look fine inside the editor. But when you compile, they look unlit, and this is due to the latest wildfire update and changes to lighting in Counter-Strike. Valve will probably fix this very soon, but in the meantime, there have been a lot of people who've experienced this and want to have a fix until an official fix comes through. So here is how you fix black prop statics to render and show up normal. This is due to when you are running and compiling your map, either using normal compile options, or if you're using fast or default expert compiling options. So when you run your map and you set everything to normal or fast, you will get black prop statics. And when you are early in the production process, you want to compile your map on fast so you can quickly play test and jump inside the game. One option is to switch over to expert mode and use full compile HDR or full compile both LDR and HDR combined. This will work, but the problem is it's going to take a long time to compile, especially when your map begins to get larger. So in order to compile your map using fast compiling options, you need to add two parameters to build lighting option. To do this, run your map, switch over to expert. Under configurations, use the drop down menu, select fast, compile run commands, select third option down, light underscore exe, and under parameters, add two additional parameters right before existing parameters and not after. First command is dash static prop lighting. Make sure you put a space right after. And second command is dash static prop sample scale space 0 0.25. And make sure you put a space at the end. And now if you compile, you will run your map on fast configuration and you will fix your black prop statics. And this is how you fix unlit black prop statics using fast compiling option. One last thing I want to mention, and it's another fix I've seen others use, and that is take their prop statics and change them to prop dynamic or prop dynamic override. And this will work when you compile using normal run map options and set everything to normal or fast. But you should not change your prop statics to prop dynamic. Most of your props should stay prop static. And dynamic props are very heavy on performance and should be used very sparingly. So avoid changing them to prop dynamic and use this fix until Valve comes out with an official fix.